Part F is asking, asking about the electromagnetic fields being out of phase. And hopefully you remember that for a good conductor, uh, we can determine that the E and H fields are 45 degrees out of phase. So since we use eta, the intrinsic impedance of the material, to relate the electric field to the magnetic field, if it's complex, there's going to be a phase shift between the electric and magnetic field. And so here there's no uh, phase shift. These are just, this is just a real number. But here, when it's a good conductor, they're 45 degrees out of phase since the real and the imaginary part are equal. So, uh, let's see. Uh, oh, we're at, okay, so if we know what frequencies the ocean is a good conductor, then we know over those frequencies the electric and magnetic fields are also out of 45 degrees out of phase. So we can say um, for all frequencies less than 10 megahertz, because that was the upper limit for our good conductor condition, then we're going to have a good conductor and the fields are 45 degrees out of phase.